Hello everyone, welcome. It's lovely seeing you all here. We are at Kakariko Village. It looks like there's a good bit of side quest stuff to do. I cannot afford the armor that I thought I was going to have to afford. Um, but that seems like that's probably going to have to be something I'll have to figure out on the side. That, that actually might be a Patreon video, so links in the description. Check that out. We'll, uh, we'll go ahead and get that up for you, and uh, we can do a little bit more shrine hunting in, in our uh, Patreon as well. I think in the meantime, what I want to do is probably go to Lookout Landing and talk to our uh, our perfect lady, Pura, uh, about, you know, where we need to go next. I think it's going to be Gerudo Village. I don't... That's the only last marker I have. I, has to, I still have a bit of the map I need to fill out, but we'll focus on that later. Let's go talk to Pura and see what she has to say. All right, we made it over here, and oh, look at that! Oh, look at that! Esu's here. I didn't know he would mean that he was coming over here when he said he's coming east. Well, that's good to know. Who's that? Oh, it's Rito. Oh, what's that old old guy's name? He's over here, and oh, the people that I felt out, like the 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 inhabitants of the Hyrule land, like they're here. That's pretty cool. Let's go talk to Hesu real quick. I want to get some uh, slots expanded. That would be extremely helpful. I've been nagging myself about that constantly. So let's talk to him. See what he got to say. Yeah. It's you. We meet again. It's been a while, huh? Yeah. yeah, it has been. So this place was built recently, huh? It's got a good vibe, and I figure it's safe since there are lots of people here. There are so many monsters all over these days. So I'm going to stay here and relax for a while. You're more than welcome. Oh, hang on a minute. Do you have a Korok seed? I do. You do! You got a Korok seed from one of the Forest Children. I have quite a few, actually. If you give me Korok seeds, I'll expand the size of your inventory. So, you want more room? Yes. Absolutely. Shalaka! Which staff should I expand? Which sh which one should we do? You know what? I think I'm kind of low on... Sh I think I only have like four slots for shield. I don't remember. I think shield would probably be important. What is it? It's okay. I just need one core oxy. Deal? Yeah, I haven't even done it once. Yeah, take it. Let the expansion begin. I'm going to skip this dance. We don't need to see it. Sweet. Okay, uh, so in order not to waste all of your, uh, y'all's time, I'm going to go ahead and have Ultima skip through this for me, uh, and then we'll just do a little brief overview on what I decided once, once I get all the way done. Alright, so I'll see you in just a moment. Alright, cool. So we got what we need, uh, it looks like, so we went by three slots for our weapons, two for the shields. I don't really feel like I go through, like, a lot of shields at once, so, I mean, there's a reason why they only start you with four slots right and three for the air the bows um i don't feel like i really needed all that much for that i probably needed more weapons in all honesty because i like to have some tools in place uh but uh there's probably some of the stuff that i could use up faster anyway but yeah, i'm glad we got that done cool um well what else was i gonna do here i was gonna talk to pura uh you know what Feeling a little bit anxious to talk to her. I might just just straight straight up go to the Gerudo region because man, is she uh, it's a little difficult to talk with her. I'll be honest with you. Yeah, it's a little difficult to talk with her sometimes. Do we go to the Gerudo region? Uh, we could probably go to the Gerudo region. And just go straight there. I mean, I know I need to go there. I don't know where else I, I would need to go. You know what? Let's do it. Let's go ahead and get to the Skyview Tower, pop up in the air, and just fly as far as we can. I don't even know if we could actually get over this lake, to be honest with you. There's no shrine over here? Man, this is gonna be a trek. Alright, well... Let's do it. <laughs> uh, maybe I could follow this path? This is clearly a bridge, right? Where is a stable? So here's my horse. Is there another stable that's over here? I could hit this stable. 
Y'all wanna do it? Mm. Do we fly across Lake Hylia? Or do we hit the stable? Let's go in the air. I like going in the air. I'll I'll take the risk. Okay. Uh I did get that one, didn't I? Oh, I'm out of pens. That's not good. Oh, that's that stable. Wow, that's a huge distance. Wait, hold on. What's this pen? Is it up in the sky? No, it's down here with us. Right? I don't even see it. Am I looking in the direction of it? Oh, I am. It's a little bit more right. I need to see if I can get rid of some of these pens so I can have a few available to me. Is this it? Oh, I haven't tagged this shrine. It's like right over here. All right, let me go tag the shrine real quick. Looks like a the Coblin encampment over there. I'm not too worried about them. Oh man, there's a shooting star. What time is it? Hold on. Oh, I have time. I'm gonna run over and get that. We're gonna go get it. Let's tag the shrine real quick and then we're gonna run and get that shooting star. We have to get that. It is a requirement. Oh my god, there's another one. Did y'all see that? Dreekong? 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 I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce that. I am terrible at pronouncing these things. Alright. Um. I don't see its radiance over there, so. Uh, let's just, I guess, go ahead and, uh, go for the one that we saw. We have until daylight. We have until daylight. We're gonna be able to get this. Look at it. Alright, we'll, we'll be able to get it. Alright, we're gonna use Tulin to get us across this gorge right here. His assistance is gonna be critical. Ugh. Oh, what a climb. Oh my god, am I going to be able to make it? Oh no. I legit might not be able to make it. Hold on. Do I have anything? Oh my god. Okay, couldn't make it. Couldn't make it. We're going a different route. We're doing something different. What time is it? Oh. Running out of time. This is not good. This is not good. Alright. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it over to there now. This is concerning. Alright, let's do this. I don't see it. Oh no. I'm losing sight of it. The sun's coming up already? At 4.30? There's no way. It's 4.30 in the morning. It should be pitch black right now. I actually don't think I'm going to be able to make it now. Um, um, man, I'm losing faith. Oh, man, this might be a misstep. Oh, no. This is not good. How close are we to that tower? Oh, my God. What time did they go away? That's my question. I don't know what time they go away, actually. Oh my god. I think I missed out. I think we missed out, y'all. Oh man. That's two of them. That's two. It's two dose I've missed out on. Look, we're gonna hope for the best, alright? I don't see any beam. Yep, I think we're missed out. Oh well. It'll be alright. We'll find one another time. I love getting shooting stars. They're so fun to get. Yep, I'm not seeing it anywhere around here. Well. Wow, they go away pretty early, don't they? That's incredible. 7 a.m.? I don't know what time they go away, though. That's the problem. That would be helpful. 
Also, if I have stamina uh, potions, that, that also helps a lot. <laughs> and some climbing gear. I need climbing gear. Absolutely need climbing gear. Anyway. Uh, back on track. Where are we going? Um, we were going to go fly. Yep. Okay, mild distraction over. Let's see, uh, there are some other pens that I could, like, get back. No. Well, we're about to go get one. So, we'll go, we'll go get that. Let's do it. Man, this thing flings you up in the air, doesn't it? Alright, um, we need to go not that direction. We need to go this direction. Is that it? Is that the tower? No? Where's the tower? That's... oh, it's in this direction. Oh, I need to be using tool into my advantage right now. There's another... Whoa, what's this? This looks like a temple or something like that. We need to get over to this. Let's do it. What's over here? Something trying to attack me, huh? Alright, we'll be able to take a little break over at this island, I believe. Far and Sky Archipelago. I haven't been to this one. This is new to me. Something's really protecting it, though. I'll say that much. Hello. That was close, wasn't it? Uh, I think it just glitched. <laughs> oh, look! There's a shrine here. Well, it's supposed to be a shrine. Um, let's not fall through there. What's this? Follow the beam to its end and offer the crystal there. Do so and I will offer you a light that banishes evil. Blake highly a crystal. Ooh, man, we gotta bring that somewhere? Yeah, I don't have time for all that right now. What we do need to do is figure out where exactly the... Hmm. Where is it? To the right slightly? Wait, is it actually? Huh? Is that a shrine? Or a tower? Hold on. I think I didn't pin the tower. And I pinned a shrine instead. You know what? Where is that tower? Oh, it's obscured by the clouds right now. I think it is. Oh man, the dragon. That makes me want to go knock it. Oh. We could probably do that. Why? I need to pin the tower. Can y'all, can the clouds go away, please? Just like, for a moment. Just like, one brief moment. Can you please just not obscure my view on things? Where is the tower? Okay, see? Man, that's way far in there. Is that it? Oh, man. All right. Well, I guess we're just going to go knock this dragon real quick. And hopefully... You know what, I think I got a scale last time. You want to get a horn? Let's do a horn. Let's do it. Uh, what do, do I have a bow equipped? I don't know if I do. Okay, I do. Let's use this one. Because you don't have to have any like particular amount of attack. Let's hit the horn. Because I think I have a scale already. I just barely grazed that thing. Alright. Don't land in the water. Oh, it's going to land in the water. It's totally going to land in the water. Alright. 
Okay. And there's an Octorok nearby. Great. That's exactly what I needed to see. Oh my god, that dragon again. Ferocious Horn. Nice. We're gonna keep that. So I'm sure that's gonna be good for like some upgrades or something later on. Did we discover this chasm? We did do it. Okay. It's two of Ferocious thing that we have. We have a scale and a horn, which is really cool. What was the other one? Oh, the claw. The claw was the other one, right? You gotta get pretty close to get that claw. Let me go ahead and make this ax real quick. I'll be, let me do this. Boink. Uh, why? Yeah, okay, cool. So now I have two axes, which is really nice. Um, put my spear back on, and then we gotta head over to Gerudo. We gotta get there. I should, I really should have brought my horse. I don't know why I didn't go that way. Um, and the path is over that way? You know what? I'm probably gonna have to redo this. Let's go get the horse. This, it just, it's gonna be faster. I know it is. Say, well, Snake, you know, it'd be a lot faster if you could just make up your mind. Look, I know. I know. You ain't gotta tell me. You ain't gotta tell me. It's just, you know, going horseback just seems kind of boring to me, but, you know, I ended up actually getting, uh... Wait, is this the first time I've been here? Oh, it is. Cool. But, you know, sometimes, uh, I do get distracted by some scenic stuff along the way, but I, I don't know. I, I like going up in the sky. It's really unique for this, this kind of game. Yeah, I still haven't even gone and checked the rewards or anything. Anyway. Uh, yeah, let's get Zwaice out. Come on, Zwaice. Let's do our thing. All right. Okay, we need to head down which path, so we're gonna go this way. East? I thought you said weast. Alright, no, I didn't want to stamp. Okay. Alright, continue down this path. We're gonna have a sharp left, eventually. Is this it? Is that it already? That's not the... Wait. Oh, we need to go this way. Whoops. Oh, turn, buddy. That's some cobblestone. Cool. So at one, one point, there was some man-made path to this. That's pretty cool. Uh, I don't see the path going forward, but I guess it's this way. Yes. It's a bit man-made through here, so it can be a little bit funny, right? Oh, wow. Yeah, I see why I can only go right. <laughs> Wait, hold on. This is a great plateau, isn't it? Gatepost Town Ruins? Oh my god, I haven't actually been through here. That's crazy. Hold on. I've got to see this. There's water behind that. Who are you? Oh. What's going on? You looking for someone to talk to? Hey, that's fine by me. Let's talk. Ah. You hear this? The Skyview Tower they built nearby got taken over. Yep, it's a monster lair now. Mm. Only fair that the monsters should pay some rent on the place. But yeah. Looks like none of us can use that place now. Really. Interesting. What's this? Oh my god. What did I just unlock? Oh no. Zwaice is right here. Zwaice, run! Run, Zwaice! Don't get flooded! What was all that about? Okay. Was that like my own? Why is that on fire? Oh, because of him. Yeah, forgot about that. Is that like the only way through here? It, this is totally the Great Plateau. That's so cool. River of the Dead. Mount Hylia? There's a lot of stuff over here. I'm not worried about that right now. We're not worried about that right now. What we are worried about is we need to get a Gerudo. And fast. We're running out of time here. Alright, I'm going this way, right? Watch out! Not to worry about them right now. Oh, look at this. They put you up against like the black macoblins pretty quick now. Yo, did we find another great fairy fountain? That's oh my gosh! You know what? It might be worth a stop. Oh. Oh, there's a horse stable. I didn't even realize that. 
stuff up in here? I have not. Fantastic. Perfect. We're getting pretty close too. Gotta check this fairy fountain real quick. Maybe one of them will open up to me. I have no clue. See, the thing is, with the first one that I found, I, I like, I really don't understand how they operate. Because last time, like, in Breath of the Wild, is just paying rupees. I'm like, yeah, that's not a problem. But this, the other one that I found, they're like, I got some riddle I need to solve. Maybe, maybe with this one I can luck out? Oh, the nerve of you coming here. Please, go away. You're just a monster who's after my blessing of clothing enchantment. The world outside my bud is filthy with gloom and full of monsters. Don't try to deny it. I know it's true. My older sister Tara told me. Even the music I love is gone. And until I hear the sound of a flute out in the world, I'll never go outside again. I moved near the stable to grant my blessings to travelers. If I heard the sound of a flute played by a musician in a troupe, I'd feel cheered up enough to come out and face the world. Okay, so we're still not getting anywhere with this because I don't know what you want about some flute and some guy in a troop. I don't understand. I don't know I don't know what I'm doing with this. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Oh look, a little rover thing. Alright, I'm not worried about all this right now. Outskirt stable. Alright, we got it tagged. Look, see, look, there's a thing. What how do I figure out this flute business? Huh? How are we gonna figure out this flute business? I don't know. We're gonna have to figure it out later. I'll talk to you later too. All right, let's go get to the let's go get to Zoyce. All right, Zoyce, we're getting close. Oh look, there's enemies over there. I don't think I want to deal with them. I'm worried about this bridge right here. There's probably a Hinox or something on there. I'm I'm almost guaranteeing that there is one. All right, where's the path again? Is this the main path? Oh, oh. Yeah, this is. They're all gonna notice me. I wanna fight. They're gonna wanna fight. I'm not worried about them right now. Dig Dog Suspension Bridge. Dig Dog. <laughs> That's funny. It's a silly name. Why is it that? Why is it called Dig Dog? Are there enemies on this bridge? Who are you? Mini Stable. That's cute. Uh. Hey, buddy, if you're going to Gerudo Canyon over the suspension bridge, you better be careful. I used to have a stable in the canyon, but ever since the upheaval sent the weather all screwy, horses hate the place. No horses meant no travelers meant no business for my stable. I was ruined. I had no choice but to relocate and open a mini stable over here. But boy, do I miss the old spot. So got both your ears, or did I talk one of them off? Anyway, let me know your name so I can confirm that you're a stable member. Uh. Your name is Link, you say? You're on the stable member list. Oh. Here, I'll give you one point to commemorate your first visit to my humble stable. Oh, how sweet. You didn't even have to do that. What a humble man. Well, it looks like you've built up a nice little pile of points. I wish I could give you something, but if you want rewards, you'll have to visit a full-fledged stable. That's fine. The closest one of those is probably Outskirts Stable, northeast of here. Yeah, the one I just left. What brings you here? Um, uh, you know what? I just wanted to talk. The inn there is closed now, but if you're gonna stop at Gerudo Canyon Stable, remember to be careful. The upheavals turn the road leading to it into a river. Getting there's sure to be a rough journey. Okay, cool. Uh, thanks for letting me know ahead of time. Oh, look, a little, uh, dispenser. What do we do when we get to the sky? What do y'all want to do? Do we want to um, maybe go find a geoglyph or something? Do a little bit of lore this episode? Oh, well, maybe. Rudo Canyon Pass. Uh-oh. Are they going to try to prevent me from going through? Um, what's going on here? Yeah, something definitely fell from the sky over here. Are they trying to prevent me? Be careful out there. There's been some abnormal weather beyond this point. Blazing heat during the day, freezing cold at night. It's dangerous to be in the area, though you can take some precautions to prepare yourself. To that end, I am going to ask you a few questions to make sure you can handle yourself. If you aren't able to answer my questions, I will not let you pass. Well, ready? Uh, sure, why not? Okay. 
Then, let's get started. Mm. Question number one. How can you best warm up when it's cold? I don't know. Maybe if I just fan myself. No, I need to pour water on my head. I'm kidding. <laughs> We're gonna stand by a, cr a fire. Correct, but the first question is the easiest one. Okay, they're gonna get a little bit harder as we go along. It's gonna get more difficult. Yep, this second question is a bit more difficult, so pay attention. All right. When it's very hot out, where should you go to cool off? We should go where it's sunny. No, I mean, I'm kidding. All right, a nice shady spot, right? Ooh. That's exactly right. I'm glad that you appear to have some survival skills. Nice, okay, well, putting me to the test today. By the way, dousing yourself in water would also be a good way to cool off in the blazing heat. Keep that in mind. Oh, thanks for giving me the answer that you didn't give before. Okay, question number three is very important and more difficult than the last two. All right, all right, I'm paying attention. What cooking ingredient is effective at fending off high temperatures? Ooh, you know what? I legitimately forgot. I'm not playing right now. I have legitimately forgot. I know someone's screaming at me. I know someone's screaming the answer at me like, you idiot snake. Please, just get it right. All right, so it's definitely not Stemelotrum. All right, so fending off high temperatures? It's the chill shroom, isn't it? Because it chills you off? Ooh. Exactly right, yes. All right, I'm impressed. Many have had trouble with that question. Uh. Last question. Oh, we got one more. Where in Gerudo Canyon could you go to avoid being affected by the extreme temperatures, day or night? Into a cave? Into the shade? Near the ruins? I don't think... I mean, all these sound kind of... Day or night? I would say a cave, right? Because caves are stable, temperature-wise. The shade isn't. Like, if it gets cold, you're in the shade, you're going to be more cold. Ruins, I mean, that's just, I don't, like, that doesn't provide any, I would say a cave. <laughs> All right, you pass. With so much knowledge at your disposal, I'm sure you'll be fine out there. Yeah. Oh, and you can take this with you, too. Oh, sweet. Oh, thanks. Appreciate that. Oh. If you cook using this, you can stay warm for a while, even at night. Anyway, you can head on through. Take care. Thanks. Appreciate it. Naya? Is that, is that her name? Naya? Um, I can't bring my horse, though. It doesn't look like I can bring my horse. So we're gonna be out without this waste. And I don't wanna have to do all that. Um, so let's go this way. All right, we're in the cold. Not too worried about that right now. Sure, I'll take a thick stick. Oh wow, it, the cold is affecting me. Oh, it's cold, cold, okay. Oh, you know what? That's because I don't have my, uh, I know what I need to do. Hold on. All right, cool. So we got this headgear on. It's going to keep us, keep us warm for right now. I don't know how having uh, braids is going to keep me warm, but you know. Okay, another flint. All right, what's the fastest route to get to that tower? I'm losing sight of my goals here. We gotta go up. We need to get up. Um, and quick. Man, screw that was off us. Oh, thanks. Not too worried about them right now. Okay, so this seems to be the path. Are they still trying to follow me? Oh, an amber. Let's just, let's just, hold on. I, got, I can take care of this quickly. Ice breath, was okay. Yep, be disappointed. Ice breath Lizafo's tail. Okay, cool. 
All right, we need to get out of here. We need to skedaddle. Get on over to the tower. Where is it? Oh, it's that way. Oh, we gotta go up all the scaffolding and stuff. Hey, look, a Korok. You need to reach your friend? I need to reach this tower. We're gonna help each other out by doing that, huh? There's a cave over there. I'm not too worried about the cave, though. Uh, tumbleweeds? What is that? Oh, wait. Um, let's use our strong one, right? Yeah. Discovery. Lower Spectacle Rock Cave. Travelers came on Claymore? I don't need that. What I will do is I'll use my little rock bit. Oh, my spear broke? I didn't know that. Rock salt. I'll take it. I'll take that. I don't have room for anything else. Um, I don't care about spears all that much, so we'll drop this. No, I didn't want you. Oh my god. That just... Okay. Alright. Um, yeah. I don't really care about going in here all that much. That just goes down further. We'll come back another time. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. Focus, Snake. Focus. Focus. Alright, so we gotta get up the scaffolding, right? I think that's probably gonna be the path of least resistance, maybe? Not necessarily the fastest one, but at least the path of least resistance. Maybe. Who knows? Right, let's get up here. We got a skedaddle. Oh, man. It goes all the way over there. We'll just start climbing this way. I am not too worried about them. Uh, what I am, what I do want to do is use a different weapon. All right. For fighting. All right. Oh! What, what was that? That was so close to getting me, like, frozen. So many Lazalfos in here. Uh, where did the other guy's stuff go? Is it all the way over here? I don't remember hitting him over here. Maybe the wind took it away. I need my axe. Now this thing. Give me some arrows. You gave me one. Okay. I'll take it. Alright. We need to get up to this. Let's go. Let's do this. We got this. It's just you and me. Alright. We're getting up a little bit high up here. Wish me the best of luck. Hopefully I don't make the wrong step. Alright. That's a little bit less treacherous of a ladder to have to climb. Is there anything up here of concern? No? Okay. Cool. Alright, so we definitely made it a little bit further. Oh, we're getting so close to this tower. Uh, I guess I'll need to go to the scaffolding that's right over here. Straight ahead. It looks like that might be the way. Alright, let's do it. We should be able to ascend. I hope so. That would make this ten times easier. Yes. Does it really need that transition animation for this? Does it honestly need that? I thought I, I figured that would be a thin enough platform that it wouldn't matter, but uh, I guess not. Okay. Well. Uh. Well. Uh. We can ascend, right? There we go. That's the way. Boink. Cool. Uh, ascend again? Hmm, I don't know. Ooh. This might be worth jumping off and getting. Swift Violet. I like these things. Okay. Um, right here. Come on. There we go. Alright, what's around me? Alright, we're good. Okay. Oh, there's those Alphos. I'm not too worried about them. I'm not too worried about them right now. What I am worried about is getting to the Skyview Tower in time. Oh! 
Oh, I hit him with the axe. I should have been hitting him with, uh, my sword. Whoops. Ooh, raw gourmet meat. Nice. All right, let's climb up this thing before these Lissalfos sit there and annoy me. Come on. Yeah, we avoided that. Avoided that situation. Great. I don't think they can get up here. They don't, they don't climb. Oh, shit, there's more. Is that, that's not a talus, is it? Please don't be a talus. No, we just need to get up to this tower. Like, as soon as possible. Ooh. I could climb. I think I could climb and get up to that. I don't see why I wouldn't be able to. I got the skills to pay the bills, baby. All right, let's get up here. Uh, I hear the music. Uh-oh. Sawson, we meet again. Good morning. Good morning. I hate to break it to you, but the sky of your tower is out of order. I'm here to fix it, but unfortunately the elevator is broken too. I can't get up to the tower to make repairs. Uh, do you see the metal bit up there? There used to be a platform attached to that. If you added enough weight, it'd go down and I'd go up. But the platform is gone. There's nothing attached to that metal bit, so I'm stuck down here. Oh. Obviously can't fix the Skyview Tower. Wish I knew of some way to get to the top. Uh, can I take this metal bit off? Let's hope so. Let's try it. Can this detach? Answer is yes. No. No. Okay. All right. Well, I can move it around, but I can't. All right. So, well, you know what? Maybe we can just straight up just attach this. Like, why not, right? Oh, there's these rocks. Because it's probably going to be a little bit too... Hey! Um... Tall? Yeah. Oh my god, am I going to... You're telling me I'm going to have to go all the way around, aren't I? Oh, here we go. Alright, folks. I'll see you on the other side, I guess. Maybe. Who knows? Let's just be sure that we... Whoops. Be extra cautious. Oh, there is a geoglyph over here. I see it. It's over there on the left. I didn't even have to bring this thing around. Oh, all right. It's hogwash. It's all right. We're doing great. Come on. Yeah, grab it. Can I attach it from here? Let's get in the shade. Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, I almost killed that guy. I'll have to get that dragon later. Can I grab it from here? I should be able to. Move. Oops. Alright, I should be a little bit more precise. Can go down? Yeah! Whoa! Hey oh! You alright? You good? Huh? Yeah, you're fine. Look, look at you. I'm gone up. Oh! Are you the one who got the elevator working? You're amazing! No, you are! I'll get to wor work fixing the Skyview Tower right away. All right, cool. Let's do it. Uh. Uh-oh. The drive assembly mechanism is stuck. Probably from all the hot, hot hours of the day here. But if I swap out those parts for heat-resistant ones... Yes, it worked! Awesome. Ah. I knew you could do it. Thanks to you, I could fix the Skyview Tower. No, thanks to you. We did it. Please, take this for your trouble. Ah, sweet. Chili steamed mushrooms. Heat resistant, too. If you're heading to the desert, make sure to protect yourself from the heat. 
it can get dangerous out there. Sometimes there's just no avoiding the heat. When that happens, a meal that'll cool you down should come in handy. So wait, hold on, what does Flame Guard do? What's the difference between the two? This is his heat resistant, Flame Guard. So these are two different things. Man, see? I should have cooked some of those recipes, shouldn't I? It'll be alright though. Where's that dragon at? He's still up above. Is that Feroche? Looks like Feroche still. Well, either way, let's get up into the sky, right? Surface map updated. And the sky map updated. Oh, there's not too much in the sky over here. All right, um, where are we gonna stop first? Maybe right behind us? South Hyrule Sky Archipelago. Um, yeah, we could probably stop over here. I don't see why not. I don't see any direct shrines. So, ooh, there's a geoglyph. Oh, 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 look at this. Perfect. Yeah, there's quite a few things over here, actually. They're more consolidated? It seems. Oh, there's gonna be a fairy over here. There's gonna be some fairies. East Gerudo Sky Archipelago. We need, um, I'm gonna need some more stamina to be able to get around. But I understand exactly why those things are here. Is it hot up here too? Look at those fairies. Let's go get some fairies. Are we gonna be able to get some? I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get any. At least one. Just give me one. One fairy, come on. All right. You gotta be kidding me. Every time I try to get under one of these things, man. Um, do I concern myself with it right now? Probably not. You know what I kinda wanna do? I kinda wanna go get that geoglyph. Y'all wanna do that real quick? Oh, oh, it's coming down to me. Dagnabbit. Just stand perfectly still and maybe it will show up. Nope. Damn. Why are you doing this to me? Why do you tease me like this? Huh? Please explain to me. Why you have to tease? You're literally just... Just... Get down here. Okay. Well... Maybe next time. All right, let's go get this geoglyph, right? Let's do a little bit of lore. We haven't seen a little bit of lore in a while, have we? Where is it? Y'all ready? It's right here. Where is the tear? I think it's gonna be right there. I mean, that's the only flat surface to be on, right? Where the water can be held. Let's do it. We got this. We got this, folks. Oh, and there's one off in the distance over there, too. I don't think I've seen that one. Wow, there's so much to do in the desert. You know what I like about Gerudo, too? Is it, it's funny because it's, it's a pretty secluded area in Hyrule. Like, it's kind of difficult to get to, in a way. You have to really go out of your way to, um, to get to it. It feels like its own little mysterious land, you know? So, that's one thing I like about it. And it's really intense once you get out here. You, you really need to use every bit of tools at your disposal when you're here. Nope, that's not the tier. You have to actually climb it? Does it actually stay up against the wall? Oh no, you know what? I think that is the tier. I might be seeing that differently now. All right, I think I can make it from here. We did. All right, let's get a little bit of lore going.
Allow me to offer you my deepest apologies. On behalf of the Gerudo, for taking so long to accept your repeated invitations. It is our desire to be accepted into the protective embrace of your kingdom. To serve it faithfully. A welcome appeal, Ganondorf. I will accept your vow of fealty to the kingdom of Hyrule. I understand that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Receiving such an appeal from you, a hero to his people and a king by birth. Well, it is truly reassuring. It is my honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king, and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. Your Majesty has certainly risen above your admirable lineage. Most impressive. Hmm. It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. All except you and your sister, that is. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings, these will endure for generations to come. <laughs> your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. I believe that man's heart holds many dark ambitions. Just his name, even that, it gives me pause. I am well aware of his evil nature. For that reason, and others, I want him close. It will be easier to keep an eye on him. <sighs> there is nothing to worry about. Okay. Okay, is that what led up to what happened before? Once he got the stones? I'm still wondering. Just still a mystery afoot here. So, curious about that. Alright, well, I think that's about all I have time for this episode. I appreciate you uh, tuning in. We'll definitely have to see you in the next one. I love you all so much. I appreciate you. I cannot tell you how much I appreciate you. We are probably going to head on down over to this little outpost next. So, once we get there, we'll probably get a little bit closer to Gerudo Town and uh, see what's going on over there. Whatever issues they got going on. Uh, again, I love you so much. Appreciate you for being here, for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.